Hello, it's Kristen, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're making probably the easiest recipe in the A to Z Ghibli food series, extremely cheesy toast from the movie The Secret World of Arietti. To be honest, it looks a lot like a glob of honey on toast, but we're going to use cheese because that seems like a tastier, easier to identify option. In a pan that's been preheating on low medium heat, add a smidge of butter. If your pan is completely nonstick, this part is actually optional because you'll see later that the cheese will create its own grease. And then you're just going to add as much or as little cheese as you want. The types of cheeses I used were sliced gouda, a block of gruyere that I grated into the pan, and in a bit you'll see a slice of provolone. You might be wondering, why these cheeses? Well, if you look up types of melty cheeses, best melty cheese, cheeses that melt really well, and the like online, you'll find Gouda and Gruyere on that list. I added the provolone because it was relatively the same shape as the bread, so basically it was just a cheese vehicle to get from pan to toast. Raclette has become the most popular melty cheese these days, but it was kind of expensive and I'm not really into that level of investment for something I'm going to devour in two seconds. During the process, you want to make sure the heat is on low or low medium so you don't burn anything. After a lot of cheese adding and pan swirling, all the cheeses you added should mix together. When it looks like they're combined, add the slice of provolone, and as I mentioned before, the cheeses will get a little bit greasy, so you can blot off the pan if you want. Be careful when you're flipping and mixing because that grease is hot. Then just stick it on your toast and it's done. You can scoot it around a little bit so that it kind of forms the shape of the bread. And that's it. If you want to make it extra shiny, you can add some melted honey on top. Some of you might be like, bleh, and others might be like, yeah, but let me tell you, that honey makes you feel extra fancy. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, please watch the other videos in my A to Z Ghibli food series. I can't believe we are almost at the end. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next one.